If you see a deal you like in the Cleveland market, make sure you send it to me before you spend a lot of money. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey everyone, welcome to the MLS Search and Analysis Show. You're watching Holton Wise TV. You've never been here before, man. Hit that subscribe button. We got a lot for you, right? This is the place where real estate investors like you can come to get unbiased advice, opinions, and in addition, we can actually help you invest, right? We are a full service real estate brokerage, uh, property management, construction, insurance title. We got it all, so don't matter where you live, okay? We can help you, right? We run the largest scattered site. Uh, rental real estate portfolio in the Cleveland market, okay? Now, my man, our money, bro. What's up, dog? How you doing? We've done due diligence on several deals thus far. Uh, this is another one that you saw that you liked quite a bit, right? But you're smart. You know, hey, man, I am out here in New Jersey. The New Jersey market is very different from the Cleveland market. So before I decide to drop a bunch of money on this property. I'm going to have my boy James take a look at it, let me know his thoughts. And you are not the only investor that I've dealt with that has been interested in this property. Uh, so I'm going to let you take a look at the footage from the last time I analyzed this. 3403 Fulton, Cleveland 44109, listed almost three months ago for $94,900. Now, this is just your standard, solid, C-grade, blue-collar, Low-end rental, right? The current tenants, uh, there are current tenants, they're cash-paying tenants, but this is the kind of property that we would go Section 8 on, right? I know you dudes love Section 8, right? The government, they always pay on time. That's what you told me, right? So this one, we don't have any photos. As you see, I just cruised through a couple of the photos. We just got the exterior. That's normal, man. Uh, a lot of people, when they're selling these, you know, the tenants, they don't want people traipsing through our house. We're dealing with COVID right now. It makes sense, right? We'll, of course, do our due diligence on the inspection. But from the interior, like these are low-income tenants, man. It doesn't really matter what color their uh, units are painted. They're probably not that clean. Uh, at the next turnover, we're, of course, going to have to do uh, freshening up. We'll have to hit it with paint, all, you know, the whole thing, right? Patch the holes in the walls, right? You guys know how these folks leave it. Uh, but right now, it's cooking, baby. It's bringing in six and a quarter and then 700. So that's 1325, 15,900 a year. And note that two unit that is six and a quarter market rent for that, dudes. When we do section eight on these, we at Holton Wise rent those for 750. And that three one will knock that one out at eight and a quarter. So right now it brings in 13 and a quarter, but it could be bringing in 1575 for the long haul. As far as performance, though, I wanted to base the performance chart off of what it's currently doing. So you guys see it. I put in all the variable and fixed expenses. This is the type of performance you dudes could anticipate, right? So this should be kicking off before the rental increase is approximately seventy-eight twelve a year. As far as price goes, uh, it's been on the market about 90 days. I think it went on and off a couple times. Ninety-four nine is not a ridiculous price for it. Of course, I'd like to try to negotiate in a little discount for you guys, though. So I think we can go up to these sellers and try to pick it up for 90 I mean, it's very much worth 90 right? You got to understand, uh, properties like this, you know, what you're going to see in this market in the in the low end, Section 8, C grade, D grade type neighborhoods is you're going to see properties occupied with tenants, uh, the mechanicals and everything. What you guys can expect is mid to end of life mechanicals, right? Nothing, not everything's going to be brand new, right? So just to give you guys some uh, information on this market, I don't know what you're paying in your market, but price points here like roofs like this, they last approximately 30 years out here. You're looking at about seven grand to replace those. Furnaces, approximately $3,000 to replace. They last 30 years. Hot water tanks going to run you about a G. They last about 15 years when you do deals like this you know it's whatever's cooking in the house right these sellers they don't just replace everything when they put them on the market so mid to end of life mechanicals probably some messy section 8 tenants this very much has a value of i would pinpoint it at 90k right hey lenders our investors are looking to work with you send us an email at sales at holtonwise.com do the deal at 90 guys that's 8.7 as your cap 
do traditional financing on it if you want. I think that's the best way to do it. I know you guys have your own cash and private money sources. But if we finance it the traditional route, you only need 22 and a half cash. The traditional loan would be 67 and a half. And it would pencil out to a 19.6 cash on cash return, right? All right, our money. Welcome back, dog. So that's what I was thinking when I first uh, looked at this property. Uh, since then, though, I've come, uh, come to find new information, right? Uh, actually presented some offers, right, uh, to the owner of this property. He also had a couple other properties that were available for sale and have come to find out that the dude who happens to own these properties uh, does not like uh, people like you, our money. He fucking doesn't like you, bro. <laughs> uh, he doesn't know you, okay? But what he doesn't like is he doesn't like out-of-state investors. Uh, he, he likes local investors is, is what I'm gathering. He doesn't want anybody to purchase his home unless they have physically walked it themselves. Uh, so unless you want to hop on a plane tomorrow and, and try to schedule a showing which by the way it's tenant occupied of course so that it's gonna make it a little difficult uh going back and forth with those tenants uh it's really just the guy's way of saying hey fuck off right he you, you get that in this business i don't know some people they really don't like uh he's a local guy i believe and some people just don't like out of town money coming into their neighborhoods and i believe that's what we have here so if you want me to submit an offer i absolutely will i got no problem doing that for you but i don't want to get your hopes up too high it doesn't look uh, like the guy is going to be very excited or interested in selling a property uh, to a New Jersey resident such as yourself, our money. But hey, that's uh, just, you know, it's an imperfect business. That's the name of the game, right? Not all sellers were created equal, right? That's why you team up with me. And uh, if the properties that you guys are finding like this one don't work out, which I don't believe this one will... Uh, I can also go out and find you properties, right? So our money, me and you, we're doing a whole bunch of properties, right? Uh, you got, I think, 40, 20 or 40 uh, properties in your account. We're going to do 20 or 40 videos for you. I can't remember off the top of my head how many we're doing. Uh, but that's going to consist of you sending me deals that you think look good, right? Just like the last one we did, all those duplexes and the single family where uh, you're like, hey, man, this is uh, looking pretty good. But before you spend all that money, I was like, hey, bro. You're overpriced by about 50 k here, right? So in addition to me helping you out due diligence on deals that you are searching for and then learning the market as I give you videos, I will also uh, keep my eyes to the ground and produce uh, videos for properties that I think will also benefit you. And again, if you want to move forward on this one, i got no problem writing up the offer for you, bro, but I wouldn't be shocked if you run into a wall like my last client. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.